I would like to quickly point out that John the Mouse video has a large selection of videos from North and South America for your viewing pleasure. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Now let's get into the cheese of the matter. This planner started out in 1877 and was targeting farmers who were tired of operating manual corn planters or those who were frustrated with corn drawn corn planters with lousy company standards of the day. This rotary drop corn planter design was going to change all that. Deere and Manzer Company was started by John Deere's son, Charles D. and Alva Manzer, that was a family business partner. They started in a small two-story building. What made them become the largest producer of planters in the world by dominating planter sales? It was a cast iron plate placed at the bottom of the planter's seed box that employed slots spaced at appropriate intervals along its edge. The slot held seeds that would be dropped at a constant rate while planting. In doing this, the planter was 65% to 85% more accurate than any other on the market. As tractors became more common on farms, a faster planter became apparent, so they built a four-row planter. This offered farmers the ability to cover 40 to 50 acres in a single day. That was unheard of. As tractors became bigger and faster, six-row models came out. Deer bragged that their planters offered farmers everything they needed in a planter. They included the same metering plates idea that could dole out 100 different types of seed. John the Mouse Travel Map is available for Google Maps. It will help plan your route to the locations of your favorite videos. It is free to use. I have the link below. Please visit the playlist tab for videos that I have sorted for you. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button.